good chance. She's a Melgar out of seven. Mally King. Vertebrae is locked into box one. It's it's a it's a favourite here. It's currently at 180. And good backing for Karma Jewels. It's coming to 660. They're just about to go. This is the second event on the program. Ready for a start for the Shamrock Hotel. Vertebrae the favourite in one racing. And Vertebrae was quickly into stride on the inside. It's showing good speed. It's going to head them off. Karma Jewels has gone to second as they run the first turn. And Vertebrae opened up, kicked away about four lengths on Shani Mac. They're followed by Karma Jewels and a length back. Shana Marie on the inside going past it now. Followed then by Bambi's Revenge and a good way back. She's a Melgar. Followed then by Mally King and too far back. Din Ying on the turn though. Vertebrae's run them along the favourite. And it's out in front. Vertebrae, they're flying behind it. But Vertebrae's two goods, one from Shardy Mac. They were followed in third by Charla Marie. Back behind those runners was uh, Karma Jules ran on fairly well at the end. Uh, it's uh, fig figured prominently for fourth and close behind it was Din Ying who made up good ground. Uh, they were followed back in behind those by uh, finishing on Bambi's Revenge and She's a Melgar. Uh, and we'll stand by for the numbers here. Number one, uh, Berta Bale has done it in, in a devastating fashion for Shannon Ellis. Uh, it's defeated for Shani Mack, number three, Shayla Marie, and number six, Karma Jules in 30 and 81. It was a fast run. Uh, Berta Bale, uh, Shannon Ellis from the inside box, has drawn away for a very good win. Came right into $1.60. It was an emphatic vic victor there. Um, Berta Bale has raced home to win in good fashion. It's owned by Paul Hawcroft. Of Wagga Paul owns a lot of uh, harness racing horses. Um, his brother.